Hey friends, good morning. This is Abhishek from TechVirus and in this video I'll be doing the performance testing of new HyperX Beast RAM from Kingston. And before I start, let me thank Kingston for providing these sample RAM kits. Now, the first thing what I noted in this RAM is the build quality. The build quality is really good and you can see that this has been assembled in Taiwan. And if you look at the heatsink all around this RAM, this black color heat sink it has been designed very nicely so that you don't have to worry about the heating issue in the RAM at all now I got these two RAMs and both the RAMs are clocked at 1600 megahertz from factory itself and it has got definitely XMP profile so that you can overclock these RAMs now let me quickly show you what is my current performance of the system and then I'll do a comparison test between my existing RAM and this Kingston RAM so let's get started so here you can see that this RAM is uh, vengeance like Corsair vengeance RAM and it's 8 GB so I'm using this uh, performance benchmarking tool to check like how is the performance of the existing RAM on my system and the RAM which I've got it from Kingston so let me run this test quickly there are lots of tests which are going on so I'll just skip all the tests and let me focus on the some specific test like how is the performance so here you can see that this is the 3d test which is going on and on and here is the result so you can see the result of this PC using the existing RAM that is my own Corsair Vengeance RAM. So here you can see that CPU is at 8922 and the 3D, 2D performance is that like 9374. But if you see at the memory performance is 1418. So this memory performance is by my Corsair Vengeance RAM. And let me show you some performance, like gaming performance, how does it perform. So let me first show you the graphic settings for this particular game. So all are high, ultra high. So you can see that this is Assassin's Creed Unity. And if you see on the top left hand side, you can see the frame rates and how much RAM it is being utilized. So you can see that 4700 MB is being utilized in this particular game. And the frame rate, what is I'm getting is 35 to 37 at this particular gaming stage. Now let me quickly show you the uh, performance of the RAM in NFS. So here is the new NFS which was released in 2016 and it is called Need for Speed. Now here let me quickly load this particular game and show you like how much time does it take to load this particular game. So in this scenario you can see that this took approximately 1 minute 59 second in my Corsair Vengeance RAM. I have not used the Kingston RAM till now so keep in mind that I am just testing my old RAM this is Corsair Vengeance RAM. And if you look at the statistics on the top left hand side, you can see that this game is running approximately at 70 frames per second and it is using 6.5 GB of RAM. So now it's time to quickly change the RAM from Corsair to Kingston. Stay tuned. Alright, now you can see that this is my PC and I'll quickly open this and I'll replace my existing RAM with new Kingston HyperX Beast RAM. Alright, so this was my existing RAM that's Corsair Vengeance and you can see that this was also 8 GB and clocked at 1600 MHz. So I'll just remove this and I'll replace it with new Kingston HyperX Beast RAM. Both look similar, both are DDR3 RAM and clocked at 1600 MHz. And let's see what is the difference between these two RAMs and how the game or the application performance increases after replacement of this RAM. Alright, so I'm done with the replacement of RAM. Now this PC contains new Kingston HyperX Beast RAM. I'll just switch it on and I'll test the performance. Now let me quickly start the performance test application. And you can see that this application is from Passmark. And if I just select the RAM, like what RAM is there in this PC, you can see that it's 8GB DDR3 Kingston RAM. And it's clocked at 1066 MHz. I think this was uh, 1600 megahertz I'm not sure like why it is showing as 1066 megahertz 
anyways let me start with the performance test of this particular RAM like I'm doing the complete test like CPU hard drive motherboard graphics card everything will be tested in this particular test and I'll see like if there are any changes in any of the parameters now we are running the 3d test and if you see the performance this performance is far better than the Corsair Vengeance RAMs in Corsair RAM the frames per second was only 70 frames now we are getting approximately 90 frames per second with this Kingston RAM alright now you can see that performance test has been completed and this PC has scored 4785 points which is approximately 700 points more than the initial test so you just saw that I have just changed the RAM and RAM has affected so many performance scores here you can see that 2d score has changed 3d scores have changed and obviously if you see the memory mark which was at 1400 now you can see that it's 1959 so there is a huge change with this Kingston HyperX RAM and both are 8 GB DDR3 RAM now by looking at these statistics you can definitely say that the Kingston RAM is performing better than the Corsair Vengeance RAM now let me do the quick test of the game and show you how is the gaming performance after changing the RAM so you can see that the frame per second has increased from 35 frames to 55 45 frames on an average so yes the frames per second has improved by changing the RAM now let me quickly check the performance of this Kingston RAM on need for speed so on top left hand side you can see that the frame per second is approximately hovering around 85 to 95 frames per second so that's quite good as we were getting only 65 to 70 frames per second in the older RAM that is the Corsair Vengeance RAM and if I tell you about the loading times using both the RAMs it has not changed much just the difference of 4 to 5 seconds alright so now it's time to install both the HyperX Beast RAM on this PC and check how is the performance Alright now you can see that we have successfully installed both the RAMs on this PC and I have just started the performance tool and the performance tool is analyzing all the hardwares which is present on this PC and here you can see that both the RAMs has been detected and here you can see that the first one is 8 GB Kingston RAM and it has been clocked at 1066 megahertz if I go to the second RAM it has the same profile and it has also been clocked at 1066 megahertz now you can see that I've started the performance test and I'll be skipping few of the videos so that I'll directly jump into the results and here the 3d test is going on on the frames per second it's still showing as 90 frames it has no change from 8 GB to 16 GB like in 8 GB also we were seeing the same frames at 90 frames per second Alright now you can see that performance test has been completed and this PC has scored 5458 which is way ahead than we were using 8 GB of RAM and here you can see that the CPU has scored 11223 and 2D graphics at 956 mark and 3D is around 10,000 marks and we don't see much difference in 3D and 2D scores but the memory score has shooted up to 3067 which is 1000 marks more than the 8 GB of RAM when we were using the same Kingston RAM but 8 GB of RAM and the last score is for the disk mark and it has not increased much alright friends so this was my complete performance test for new HyperX Beast Kingston RAM and I hope you liked it if you like do subscribe my channel and if you have any other questions or queries mention in the comments below have a nice day bye bye